Yo, what is going on everybody? It is Tristan. Just started the screen recording and today in this video what I want to discuss is kind of giving you all some information on how you could potentially cop the City of Love SB Dunk Low. Now, a couple things I want to say about this SB Dunk Low. Um, they haven't actually started appearing at many skate shops yet. I would expect this in the next couple of days. At the moment it is just on sneakers, but with most SB Dunk Lows we see them at skate shops as well. They're SBs, so I mean you know, skate shops have that contract. They're going to go there. Uh, if Nike has planned that, you know, I'm, I mean, I wouldn't see any reason why they wouldn't go to skate shops and just drop on sneakers. That would be really weird for an SB. But we'll get into all the details. If y'all want more content like this, y'all can check out my Instagrams down below. I'm always buying uh, and selling kicks here. Y'all can see I've been posting uh, some early looks, you know, stuff like that. So if y'all, you know, interested in that, see what I have for sale on my story, just check me out down below there. And if y'all like undermarket sneakers, don't forget in Hype Labs, that's what we do every single day. So y'all can see some of the ones we've done recently. We've done some, you know, other uh, rare recipes. You can see some people commenting on that. And yeah, we've done tons so far. So don't miss out. Hope to see y'all there. You can just join that wait list and you can also see everything else offered and you'll get a response in 24 hours. But that's it. Enough of that all there. Uh, and let's get started on discussing the City of Love SB Dunk Low pack. Big fan of this. So first things first, as you guys can see uh, with the SB Dunk Low, again, this is the Burgundy Crush colorway. Overall, I'm a pretty big fan. I mean, this is probably the one that is more hyped out of the two. You can see they're both dropping at the exact same time, February 9th, 10 a.m. Eastern time. And it is via, uh, it's not going to be a draw. It's just gonna be one of those short, little two, three minute uh, releases. You're gonna wanna enter, you know, as quick as possible. You can wait till 10.01 or 10.02, but uh, me personally, I would just try and be quick since it's not, uh, you know, a draw. So, I mean, waiting doesn't really benefit you per se, right? Because with the draw, you have the full 10 minutes. You can enter at the end of the draw and sometimes that gives you better odds because again Nike spreads out the dubs throughout the whole entire time frame so you know use it but with this you don't really have a time like as large of a time frame and it's more or less the first come first serve release so you're gonna you're gonna want to be early that's one of the main things I'll mention so dropping at the same time you don't have to choose one you can enter for both uh, and yeah which is kind of you know again you can see some of the small details unique insoles on them uh, kind of this you know I guess well, it is a burgundy colorway. So we got kind of a burgundy suede kind of in the center here. My, it looks like that might be on the tongue tag as well. I could be wrong. Uh, I was looking for an early pair of these. Just, you know, I struck out. But I did get some other ones, like some Kobe's. So we got some other early pairs and the pretty cool pair of Jordan 4s, which will be dropping later this year on the way. Y'all probably know what I'm talking about. Uh, but aside from that, you know, again, this is still a pretty nice one. Uh, this is probably, the out of the two that we have here, the one I actually would wear would probably be this one. This is just because I, I I don't have any SB that's like this one. I have some SBs that are kind of similar to this, you know, like some kind of reddish, uh, maroonish SBs. But I mean, this, I don't, um, I don't have anything really like this per se. So it would be kind of interesting, you know, and the insoles are pretty cool on these, you know, you, it stands out a little bit. I believe you have a unique logo uh, on the tongue tag as well here, kind of like some more uh, detailed photos. So why don't we just, you can see the suede too, really, really nice. Uh, I'm not sure what material they're choosing. Like I've no clue, like it looks like a silk material almost like on, on like around uh, the swoosh and also like underneath here on the toe box, on the tongue tag. Again, that's just what I think. Yeah, maybe a little bit of a, a stretch saying it's like renaissance. <laughs> <laughs> techniques but they are nice you know they are nice I'm not denying that so why don't we check out the resale prices remember those drop dates keep those in mind since again these will probably be at skate shops a week or two later or you know they'll drop right at around the same time like in the next week or two we could just see a punch a bunch of skate shops post them they could just be waiting till February totally realistic it is a February release so that would make sense but as you guys can see prices right now are between like 270 to 320 ish uh, smaller sizes are going for more since again this is mainly um, you know city of love SB pack it's kind of women's I, I will I mean it's like Valentine's Day themed I guess if you want to put it like that so I don't know my lady's going hard for these that's why the smaller sizes are going for more I believe on both colorways let me just double check this yeah in both colorways the smaller sizes are well <laughs> other than like once you get past size 11 you know then that's where it starts getting really limited like look there is <laughs> there isn't even a 13 listed so yeah I feel for uh, whoever that you know is 13 well we're you're just gonna have to wait for your local shopper sneakers because uh, yeah there's <laughs> no pairs being listed like a week or two before the drop that just shows you it's a pretty limited release but uh, also right here again you just see again smaller sizes are more expensive just kind of a quick note I wanted to show you guys but expect these to drop in price don't 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 go out the way and buy these now unless you really need them for the personal collection I just I wouldn't do that because i mean they're going to drop in price the release is literally uh like two weeks away so i mean if you just want to wait for that i would do that it's not um you know these actually might get overshadowed a little bit in my opinion as we get closer to the bread reimagines i feel like people will focus on these but people are also just going to want to focus so badly 
um, on the Brits because again, there's going to just be a lot of potential there. I mean, the grade school sizes of those to hold. I mean, that's like that's the easiest play in the world. <laughs> so yeah, I'm 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 definitely going to be in on that. You know what I mean? But aside from that, uh, if you guys need to check your local skate shop and where that is, just go to NikeSB.com/shops, type in where you're at, and I'll show you some shops near you. Uh, that will most likely be getting pairs of these. If you go to the vault right now, actually NikeSB.com slash the vault you check it out uh it actually doesn't show anything it shows you the recent like you know nike sb air max shots that they did that was three colorways for those they, they, they did two at once and then they did uh the you know the recent colorway they also had these blazers pretty cool uh, i believe you can like scratch it away and it reveals kind of like this red colorway underneath i could be wrong but hasn't appeared with anything yet about um you know this release the city of love sb pack so i am wondering like okay are these are these hidden shops like why would they just load it on sneakers and not send it to skate shops that would be very that'd be very very weird for sbs hopefully y'all understand that like why would they not send a skate shoe to skate shops but they would do it on sneakers i would be again would be confused but i mean there's no reason these wouldn't be at shops i'm sure there's a skate shop or two that's probably posted raffles for these i just haven't quite seen it yet because it's probably not you know to my area i would get that but i'm sure some skate shops in like california and oregon these are usually like some of the first areas that will post raffles so i'll, I'll check that out later today get some confirmation on that if i end up seeing some raffles i'll you know edit something in uh so you guys will be notified of that but just make sure you guys are checking nikesb.com slash shop so you can see where yours is make sure you get them followed on you know follow them on instagram but yeah, don't be calling them up asking about the raffle. They, I, I, they probably would not like that because they get a lot of calls of that exact question. Just wait for them to post on their Instagram like 100% of the time. That well, no, <laughs> that's a kind of a you know strong percentage to go with. But majority of the time, a skate shop is going to post on their Instagram when they have a raffle or first come first serve for a sneaker. They will let you know. So that's really what I can mention. Again, both these smaller sizes are going for more, so just keep that in mind. Or if you're just getting 11 plus, I mean you're you're sitting on some real money with this pair because people really like this one. Between the set, I've seen more demand for the burgundy one, but I'm not saying again this one is not hyped like. It's an SB. SBs are probably some of the more, if not the most hyped dunk low right now. It's the sneaker Nike's really running with. You see, they're going to do maybe some with SB and Kobe later this year. Like, they're just really, they're really, you know, without anything SB, they're like, Let's do it. So, I mean, yeah, that's just, that's Nike's uh, plan for this year. It's probably really going hard on SB Dunks. So, a lot of those, like, you know, collabs from last year are going to become really, really valuable just because I don't think they're going to compare to the ones this year. I think the, you know, SBs this year will be good, but um, I don't think there will be anything like last year's. Last year's just had some really niche ideas, and uh, I'm holding a lot of those pairs because I just think um, those are going to be the ones that are more sought after, to be honest, the 2023 collabs. So, that's it. Uh, I'm not saying there won't be a banger or two this year, though. So, look forward to that if y'all want more content though uh just like this again let me know what y'all think about these releases and feel free to check me out on instagram y'all can subscribe and like down below i'm just trying to like 200 likes on this video and if y'all need anything sneaker related again i'm always buying and selling here so just hit me up uh, i'm trying to buy pairs of the power puffs right now i've been doing that for like the last about i mean <laughs> i've been buying pairs since you know kind of before the release um i mean y'all can tell i have the early pair video but i've been buying these up since like drop day uh so i mean yeah if anybody wants to sell me pairs just hit me up there i'm buying some uh and yeah again if you're looking for any pairs in particular i got some like 11.5 travis scott fragments stuff like that for sale um I i'm not doing any trades for those so do not ask about trades for the fragments I I'm, I'm sorry just too valuable of a pair for me to do that at the moment but uh yeah if y'all want to see you know some of our under market deals check us out of hype labs don't you can see some of the recent ones on the screen too so you can see people are getting those aren't missing out uh and yeah if you want to cook with us just go down here get in that wait list and you'll get a response in 24 hours you see everything over there. That's it. I'm in that screen recording. I'm Tristan. Hopefully, I see y'all down below in the comments, on my Instagram, or, you know, in the group, wherever I see you. So, I'm T. Thank you, guys. And hopefully, i catch you on the next one. Coming very soon. Peace. It becomes the cup. You put water into a bottle. It becomes the bottle. You put it in the teapot. It becomes the teapot. Now, water can flow. Or it can crash. And water, my friend. Sticks made a fucking hit.